We've got 10 of the world's most craziest Minecraft TikTok hacks that will change the way that you play the game literally forever. Don't believe me? Check this one out. What if I told you that you could use a chest and actually lock it with your own custom item? Check this out. So this is my chest right here. If I don't want any of my friends or anybody whatsoever to get inside of this chest, there's a little bit of a trick that you can use to actually lock this. And guess what? You're the only person that can open it. All we have to type is slash data merge block followed by our coordinates. Then we do a squiggly bracket and type in lock colon followed by any secret name that's going to allow you to open the chest boom all right so check this out if i try and open this chest anvil won't work even the cobblestone won't work it literally says at the bottom chest is locked okay we completed half the hack but now we got to figure out how to open it i want you guys to guess down below in the comments out of all these blocks in my inventory which block is going to open the chest crips and stem also not opening it can i open the chest with a chest no i can't but if i use this item with the name on it secret which is what we typed in the command previously check this out boom we can officially open the chest oh my gosh dude that is so cool all right confirmed this this one is gonna be a game changer. All right, so the first one was cool, but what if I told you you could actually turn your Minecraft hand into a fireball maker? Yes, literally. I know it sounds crazy, but you can actually shoot fireballs. Kind of like this! <laughs> First, we got to go ahead and grab a command block. Now, listen, if you're playing in a survival world, you can go ahead and give yourself a command block, okay? If you want to try out these hacks, it's honestly super worth it, and you can do a lot of really cool stuff with this. Now, once we're inside of the command block, we're going to type in this following command. Summon Minecraft Fireball Squiggly Squiggly 3 Squiggly Curly Bracket Explosion Power 50 Direction Colon Bracket 0 0 0 0 0 zero squiggly bracket boom now assuming this should work i should be able to just punch oh wait it's not it's not it's not working oh wait hold up hold up always active there we go boom wait, what the heck wait, do i have to be in survival mode or something oh wait what it was above my head wait how did how did they get there wait, 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 hold up hold the phone what wait how do i how do i get it back hello <laughs> there was a fireball in my head but now it's gone i am very confused as to what happened because now it's not there repeat ah yeah oh uh oh uh oh oh god we're gonna break it oh my gosh now we have infinite fireballs this may or may not be game breaking but we literally have infinite fireballs right here and this is probably gonna crash your world so be cautious with this one but this one works oh my god wait what's happening everything's blowing up i didn't even realize wait what what is happening i am losing fps faster than my grades drop dude what is actually happening okay okay we gotta escape to another biome. Get out of here. Get out of here. Please, and if you guys seriously haven't already, you have to leave a like on today's video, okay? It like literally tells the YouTube algorithm, hey, I enjoyed this video and other people like myself should probably be seeing this video and enjoy it as well. So go ahead, leave a like. It would mean a lot to me. Thank you. Have you ever wanted to create a curse block that all your friends will be super confused over? Like I'm, I'm, I'm talking confusion 500. That is this next hack. First things first, all you wanna do is go ahead and build another portal. All right, so check this out. We have officially have a portal. Whoa, that looks really glitchy. What is even happening? All right, so the next thing you wanna do here, this is actually very simple. Simple. Go ahead and set up a piston right beside the portal and then go ahead and put some TNT in front of the piston. Then what you're going to want to do, put a lever right there so you can activate the piston. Now check this out, okay? If we go ahead and light this TNT and push the piston inside of the portal, this should create a very cursed block that literally nobody will be able to explain. Check this out, okay? Three, two, one, go, 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 go. <gasps> okay, please work, please work. Oh. Wait, what? Wait, what just happened? What? That, that literally that literally failed so much. I, I, I'm so confused. Maybe I did it wrong. I don't know. Okay, what if what if we put the TNT in the portal first? Oh, see, but now the piston won't move when it's not ignited. Bro, what? Oh, what? Now it won't even go. What is happening? Third time's the charm. Let's try this another way. Okay, we're going to ignite first, then ignite the portal, and then push. What? It still won't even go. How did we get it the first time? What? Okay, so now it pushes it. Now, if we light it, it also pushes it. Okay. Oh. Oh, my. Okay. You know what? Unfortunately, this one does not work. This is our first L of the day. Have you ever wanted to show somebody a little bit of extra appreciation they have for them? Maybe a little bit of love? I like to call this the love portal of friendship. Yeah. <laughs> Now, this one's more of a building hack, but it's still really cool anyways. So I'm going to go ahead and place some red terracotta down just like this. Now, let's go ahead and find the middle block here. You can do something just like this. All right, cool. Next thing we want to do is go ahead and place command blocks all just like this. Now, inside of these command blocks, we have to type in a super special command. Particle, Minecraft, heart, squiggly, squiggly, two, squiggly. Wow, I spelled heart wrong. I'm such a bot. And boom, there we go. Now, we have to make sure it's always active. Oh, look at that. Check that out. There's a bunch of hearts coming out. Now we can do this on all of them. Now you got to make sure you set the command block to repeat and always active. Boom and voila. Check this out, guys. We have a bunch of love particles. Now we can go ahead and fill this up and make like a cool little, make like a cool little area for it specifically for your loved one. This is the amount of love I have for you guys watching this video right now. Okay. I built this just for you. I told you that you could build it for somebody you appreciate and love for. Well, guess what? I built it for you. I freaking love you guys. And if you want to give me a heart back, just go ahead and subscribe right now. 
Thank you so much. Listen, I'm going to be honest for a minute. How cool would it be if you could have aimbot in Minecraft? And no, I'm not talking about a Minecraft hack client aimbot. I'm talking about a vanilla command block aimbot. This one's a little bit big, so bear with me for this one. But let me tell you, when it's finished, it's really cool. We have five command blocks here, and we have to set them up just like this. One eternity later. I just spent the last 10 minutes writing in all those commands, and oh my gosh, let me tell you, this is one of the most annoying things we've ever done. But if this works, this is going to be a great success. All right, so the first command block, we have a scoreboard. Second command block, we have whatever this this thing is i have no idea now this is giving me an error which is why something's wrong here i just don't know i don't know why i've never given up on a tiktok hack i am just doing something wrong here and i, I just i know this works but it's no rip all right babe not doing it so to lift everybody's spirits to the next tiktok hack that we have it actually works in bedrock and it is and it allows you to be super giant like literally huge give command block okay there we go now all we have to do type in the super simple command and literally we will become giant play animation at e animation gas scale f250 and apparently if i do this it should just magically work uh okay what do i is that it is am i am i done Huh. Wait, maybe I have to get a lever and maybe I have to get a lever to turn this on or something. And oh my gosh, what the, yo, what? The? <laughs> Dude, I'm freaking massive. So wait, I, I'm not actually big. My player just looks massive. Wait, wh what the heck? Wait, gas scale. Oh my gosh. Wait, hold up. Can you modify this with other moms? Animation gas scale. What if we did like animation bat scale uh, and then flick it off and then flick it back on? Huh, that also doesn't work. Oh, that's so weird. What the heck? Well, anybody on Bedrock that wants to become giant, there you have it. Super easy way. You know, Star Wars is great and all, but wouldn't it be really cool if you could actually have the force and like move things such as this cow? Well, well, check it out, everybody. You actually can. We're going to need another command block. Yes, I know this video has been all command blocks. Execute as at a at at a run. What does this even mean? I, like this, this all makes no sense. TP at E player distance. 10. Okay, boom. Now this random command that we just punched in apparently is supposed to give us the force field in Minecraft. Let's see if this actually works. Let's grab some villagers here. We'll just place them all around. Now all we got to do is go ahead and activate the command block. Aha! I got it to work. Let's go. Okay, so what, what, what I was doing wrong at the very end, you have to do these these like three up arrows and then a six at the end guys look i can literally carry all the mobs here no way wait so if i got like a gas for example oh my gosh everything i've dreamt of i can control the world go <laughs> now above ground gas tell me you love me say it again oh they're dead never mind <laughs> Cool villager, get over here. Get over here. Get over here. Yeah. Goodbye. Oh my gosh, dude. This is this is literally game breaking. Imagine the trolls that you can pull on all your friends. Summon Ender Dragon. Oh my gosh. It works on the freaking Ender Dragon. Wait, we could yo, we could use the Ender Dragon as like our own mine. He could literally just mine a bunch of blocks for us. I mean, check this out, guys. This dragon's literally just mining for us. Look at this. Now, this is what I like to call an efficient nuker. Why use a hack client when you can just use the force and have an ender dragon do all the work for you? Am I right? Yo, what? This is amazing. Thank you, Mr. Ender Dragon. Oh, my gosh. If any of these hacks inspired you and made your day a little bit better and changed the way you play Minecraft, be sure to subscribe to my channel right now. And, of course, I'll catch you guys in tomorrow's video. Peace out.